Hi there, welcome back to the Dreamkeeper channel. So this one today is a vision that I had, and I had it a while ago. Uh, also like I, I hate visions when I meditate and what I do is I, I take a note of them, create like a picture to go with it, and then uh, like that way I can make a video about it in the future. So I had this a while ago, I was discussing it with people on a, a spiritual Facebook group. But then when I found out about the solar eclipse, I thought like the picture kind of looked like an eclipse, even although I never like knew about the eclipse or I didn't even, I suppose it's not like an eclipse because it's not the same shape, it's not round, but because of the orange glow and stuff, it kind of reminded me of the eclipse. And with the eclipse happening tomorrow, I thought I'll, I'll just bring this video forward and release it eh, tonight kind of thing, today. Eh, so this one is called Crisis and Revelation, the sky was torn and uh, like I say it was a vision I had, uh, was, I don't know, maybe a few months ago, uh, but like I say the more I, I thought about it and that, like I say I was discussing it with people and it was quite weird, it was in a spiritual Facebook group and it was somebody from America and they were like an Aries as well, I'm an Aries and they were saying they had seen something similar when they were meditating but obviously it can all mean different things to different people but uh, I was looking it up in that and it was it was quite interesting what it was saying and uh, I th like I say I thought it would just be quite relevant with the, the solar eclipse because it, it does kind of look like an eclipse obviously it's just no circular but that's, that's what I've seen, so I don't know if it was related or if it's not related, but uh, this is what it says anyway. So, it says, uh, The tear in the black night sky, outlined in orange, could symbolise a moment of awakening or a significant breakthrough in your consciousness. Black often represents the unknown or the subconscious mind while orange is associated with creativity, passion and spiritual transformation. The vision could suggest that you're on the verge of discovering new insights, experience a shift in perspective or undergoing a profound transformation in your life. It may be a sign to pay attention to your intuition and inner guidance as you navigate, navigate through this period of change and growth. So that's that's basically what it was like. It was like a, a dark black night sky, and it was like the orange kind of. It was like a, a tear, like in the sky with an orange kind of glow around about it. Uh, and so what that saying, kind of, it's just talking about it. And uh, I have been gone through like a bit, like. I don't know again like I'm a bit up and down recently and stuff and I've had a lot going on kind of mentally and stuff and I do tend to notice that whenever there is kind of like full moons or kind of events I seem to go a bit eh, a bit offline we'll say eh, a bit a bit eh, mad but I don't know again I always relate it to my mental health kind of thing because like I'm up and down and eh, so it, like again maybe I do need like to I'm experiencing a shift and going through a tra transformation every time these kind of events happen but for me I would probably need to work on it and learn how to deal with it better so I'm not like all over the place and stuff like that but uh, this is uh, the next one what it says is uh, a vision of a torn black sky with an orange glow resembling a solar eclipse can carry several symbolic meanings in spiritual contexts. So, number one, transformation and transition. The torn black sky may symbolise a rupture or break in the fabric of your reality, suggesting a period of significant change or transition in your life. The orange glow, reminiscent of a solar eclipse, could represent the merging of light and darkness, symbolising integration of oppos opposing forces and the potential for profound transformation. 
<coughs> so again, it sometimes feel like <coughs> like there is like I'm always in transition. I don't know if it's just me or yeah. And obviously I've got the dark and light sometimes. Again, that's what I do feel like. Like I'm unbalanced. I've got like quite. I can be quite dark at times. Like dark vision kind of stuff and. Uh, again, I don't know if it's related to, like, like I'm soaking up all the kind of energies, like soaking all the energies up round about me, and there's quite a lot of negativity in that in the world now, so I don't know if that's what affects me, knocks me off balance, and, like, but I don't know, Ken, but it is, it, it's definitely affects me, because I've noticed it over the years, that when certain things happen, because I, I can be going along fine, and then, like, I just out of nowhere, then I'm just, I'm like totally down kind of thing. So it's, it's a bit mad, but like I say, I'm trying to, like, now that I'm aware of it, and just trying to work it out, try to navigate it kind of thing. Uh, so this is the next one, the, the title of the, the video, Crisis and Revelation. The torn black sky could sig signify a moment of crisis or revelation where hidden truths or deeper aspects of your psyche are brought to light. The orange glow may indicate the illumination and hidden knowledge or insights guiding you towards greater awareness and understanding. And I think that's basically what I've just been saying. Sometimes I do feel like a bit of crisis point, like we like again it's like my mental health it's like one minute you're fine next minute you're in a crisis kind of thing you're sky high down low it can be quite hard to to get balance in that so it's like kind of is like a revelation that i need to sort this out so like so i'm more on like a stable kind of steady path so i'm not just kind of up down where the place kind of thing like happy and sad and stuff it's like a bit of a roller coaster at times it can be quite Again, it can take a lot out of you, kind of thing. You just kind of disappear for a while, but yeah, I'm not getting better at dealing with it, kind of thing. Yeah. The next one is uh, balance and harmony, and obviously that's what I'm looking to achieve. So the contrast between the darkness of the torn sky and orange glow could symbolise the balance between the light and shadow, day and night, or opposing forces in your life. It may suggest the importance of finding harmony and equilibrium amidst chaos or uncertainty. Again, that's just basically what I've been saying. I need to find basically balance and harmony. I need to start like, like realigning myself, like being aware and like stuff's gone on and not just letting it overtake me before and before like I know it, I'm like a way down or a way up. It's like I need to try and find balance and harmony and within myself but within my life and that as well uh, and the next one the last one is a uh, spiritual awakening uh, in some uh, in some spiritual tra traditions eclipses are seen as powerful portals for spiritual awakening and transformation the torn black sky an orange glow may symbolise a heightened state of awareness or a shift in consciousness leading to a deeper connection within the divine or the universe. So it could be that as well. It could be like, um, like because the spiritual awakening stuff has shot through the roof the past probably year. And that's why I'm doing all this, the videos and stuff. So maybe it's like I'm struggling to deal with that. Like I'm struggling to find my way through it, so it's like I'm up and down and happy and sad and left and right and dark and light. And <laughs> get what I mean? Like, oh, just like all other place, because uh, it is quite like if, I dare say if you've experienced stuff like I have, it's like you you'll know how hard that is. And even if you know, if you just have like mental health issues or that, you'll know because I dare say everybody does at some point. It's quite hard to. Because you've got all these feelings and thoughts and like you're happy and sad and all this kind of thing. So uh, 
that's that's what I, that could mean to me. And the last one here, just like a summary, it says, overall, the interpretation of a vision like this can vary based on personal beliefs, emotions, and the context which it occurs. It may serve as a reminder to embrace change, seek inner balance, and trust the, trust in the process of transformation unfolding in your life. So that's basically saying I just need to trust what's going on, eh, just embrace it, and I'll find my way through it, kind of thing. Eh, which is good advice to me, kind of thing, like, and probably a lot of people. Eh, but again, I just, like I say, I thought like, it was a while ago that I had this. But when I looked at it, the more I looked at it, and I was, like I say, I was discussing it in a Facebook group, and then they were, somebody was saying they had the same vision. They were an Aries, just like what, what I'm a, It was my birthday on Friday kind of thing, so, yeah, like, yeah, so I, like I'm an Aries, basically, and it was quite strange that they were saying they were an Aries. And obviously I hadn't says that I was, but yeah, they were saying that, so I kind of connected that. So I don't know if it's like an Aries kind of energy or if it's related to the solar eclipse, because as you'll see the now, they both look pretty much similar or sim similar-ish, I'd say. Just with like the, you've got the dark and then the light round about it and stuff. So I wonder if uh, this eclipse tomorrow is going to bring in some kind of realization like revelation for me some kind of change yeah maybe be the same for you or a lot of people or also i'll not see it for where i'm or in scotland i think we only see a wee tiny bit of it so it's barely nothing but there'll be people obviously all like at certain parts of the world that will be able to see it and stuff yeah that would be a really big event so i thought it'd be cool just to release this video because it could be connected it could not be I don't know, it's hard to say with these things, but they definitely look similar and uh, maybe tomorrow I'll wake up with a, a revelation and I'll be on my way, <laughs> kind of thing or, or that, eh? But uh, if you are able to experience the, the eclipse tomorrow, uh, I, I hope you enjoy it and that. It should be, I'd imagine it'll be a really cool event and really again a, an experience to be there kind of thing so uh, if, if you're if you're able to see it then good on you and i hope you enjoy it and uh, but as for this video that'll be that and uh, like i say i'm just i'll see see what happens tomorrow if i feel any different or if i have any visions or that but uh, if you've enjoyed the video remember just to to give me a wee subscribe that it's basically saying that 90% of the people that are watching are not subscribed. So, like, if I could get even, I don't know, just like any kind of percent would be good. It's good just to grow the channel, keep things going. But, uh, let's well, say that's that uh, for this one anyway. So, uh, I hope you've enjoyed that and enjoy the, the eclipse tomorrow. And uh, I'll see you soon.